Some of the main highlights of today's event included absolute experts in big data and machine learning. Uh, we learned from people that are literally living and breathing big data using cloud computing, using technologies that most people are unaware of, but have found a way to take advantage of them. The, the presentation that I liked most today was uh, Ichihan's presentation. He introduced a very interesting concept of, of lean, uh, lean research for you to dig into certain hypotheses and test out potential strategies in a, in a, in a cost-efficient way. And, and he highlighted Ravenpack as a data set that could be used for, for these type of things. I really like the completeness of the Ravenpack's data sets, where the, especially for newcomers, people can use the relevant back data sets to deliver a small success that's visible to more people in the organization. I think that's a very essential to new adopter of big data. I liked how Peter introduced the Ravenpack product. He described it in a few minutes in a way that really made a lot of sense and really made it clear why you might be interested in using this as an alternative data source. The one immutable truth in our space is that data in motion is more valuable than data at rest. So I really still think we're in the infancy of our space. And I do think that there's a lot of maturation that has to occur because right now what we're doing is, is we're testing data that ends on a daily cycle or a monthly cycle. And um, I, I think the future of this is going to be how do you manage data on a 24 by 7 cycle. The estimation challenges that we have with the data, uh, the fact that uh, it's something more that can be done uh, we, when in the presence of uh, in the presence of weak classifiers, the weak regressions, right? So I think there's a lot to be done on that. As human beings, we've worked for centuries on intuition which is basically boiling down the large amount of experiential data that we see in the world around us into things that we can reason with. Machine learning needs to help us do the same thing, but on this grander, larger scale, this global scale of continuous information flows. Do I think AI is going to have a big impact? It's absolutely going to have a big impact. Uh, big data is certainly becoming a huge part uh, of everyone's investment process and needs to be. I think the potential of it is still um, more unknown uh, at, at this point and still needs to be in a little bit more of a prove it to me stage. Uh, but if you're not looking at it, uh, you're clearly behind the curve. This is Raven Pack.